Hey, I'm going to show you a little tip about how to get your Swift Playgrounds unstuck if you happen to be caught in kind of a weird situation. This might help, it might not. Um, this is specifically for a, a new piece of content that we developed called Drawing Flags. Uh, and if you're using an iPad that's not set to English as its default language, uh, you might see this issue with our walkthrough. So let me show you what, what's happening. So if we open up Swift Playgrounds, uh, we can see our new uh, Drawing Flags app there. It's available in the Code Hub Adventures Swift Playground feed, uh, which you can get by going to the codehub.ie slash playgrounds. So I'm going to open up the, the app and we can see we, we have the familiar walkthrough banner at the very top where it's saying that, hey, we can learn more about this particular walkthrough. Uh, in this app, we practice drawing different flags and using H stacks and B stacks in Swift UI to compose different views that look a lot like different nations flags. But when I tap on that learn more button, at the moment, this is what I'm seeing, which is not a great experience for a walkthrough. It's the same thing if I tap on that little uh, library icon up there at the top, this isn't very helpful. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to turn on author debug mode for Swift Playground. So let's go see how to do that. So first I'm going to go off to the, the settings app here. I'm going to scroll down to the bottom. We have a list of settings over on the side. Playgrounds is where we want to go. So I'm just going to tap on Playgrounds. And this is the switch here. Now I have my iPad set to Italian as the main language. So it may read something different in yours. So I've turned that on. Now I'm going to go back to Swift Playgrounds and check out my Drawing Flags app again. So I'm going to open up Playgrounds. It doesn't look like anything's changed, but if I hit the X at the top left-hand corner of the screen and then relaunch that same Playground, Now I'm going to have more information about the, the walkthrough. Now you can see maybe up in the upper right hand corner, the thing that's selected is the preview view. So when I hit learn more, now I can walk through the walkthrough just fine. So this is just a little workaround for now until that gets fixed or until I provide different translations for the walkthrough. It's a really handy because now we can walk through all of the steps that tell us all about how to build our flag views. Now, if you're using Swift Playgrounds on the Mac, it's similar, even easier. For that, we can go to the Playgrounds app and just go up to Playgrounds, Preferences, and toggle this switch here, Author in Debug Mode, and you're good to go. All right, I hope that's fixed some of your problems. It also fixes a host of other problems that you might see in Swift Playgrounds. Uh, so it's worth trying to toggle that on and off and reload whatever playground or app you're working with in Swift Playgrounds. Uh, give it a shot and best of luck with drawing flags.